If you like our video, click the button to subscribe to our channel and get easy access to new content. To see our full suite of ad-free video courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides, visit us at www.teachucomp.com. You can also apply a single payment amount from a customer to multiple outstanding invoices for that customer by placing a check in the checkmark column that appears to the left of the invoices against which you want to apply the cumulative payment amount received until the total payment has been distributed to the correct invoices. To do this, select Customers, Receive Payments from the menu bar to open the Receive Payments window. Then select the customer or customer job who sent you the payment from the Received From drop-down. Enter the payment date, amount, and payment method at the top of this window. QuickBooks will automatically attribute the amount entered against all of the outstanding invoices shown from oldest to newest. You can check and uncheck the invoices by clicking into the leftmost checkmark column to apply and remove payment amounts as needed until the entire amount received has been attributed to the correct invoices in the correct amounts. You can also change the amounts applied to each invoice if needed by changing the amounts shown in the Payment column at the right end of the outstanding invoice list. After you have attributed the single payment received to the correct outstanding invoices in the correct amounts, you can then either click the Save and Close or Save a New button to save the transaction and then either close the window or open another new transaction window. Remember to click the subscribe button to see more of our videos. See our full suite of courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides at www.teachucomp.com.